That's such a peaceful day. <laughs> so peaceful and quiet. Nothing ever goes wrong on a peaceful day. Hmm. Actually, come to think of it, as great as this piece is, it's actually kind of boring. It'd be more fun if something exciting happened. Like if all my friends just came first out of the sky! <laughs> but that's not this. Something like that would never happen on such a peaceful day. Huh? Oh my! What's happening? I think someone's bursting out of the sky! Oh, that, that hurt! But hey, I'm in one piece! Amity, how'd you get here? Hey, Carby, it looks like we got warped to another dimension! Go, go! <laughs> Arl, Carbunkle, I don't understand! Hi, Yoringo, how's it going? <laughs> hey, Amity! Well, let me guess. You two were in a Puyo Puyo battle, huh? And you both popped a whole bunch of Puyos. And suddenly, some mysterious power picked you up and sent you. Just like that! <laughs> Go, 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 go! Long time no see, Ringo. Looks like you're doing well. I feel like this happens to us a little too often. There's no telling where we might end up. That's not such a bad thing, is it? I mean, it brought us to your world, right? Yeah, that that's the best part about having Puyo battles. <laughs> I can't argue with that. Well, let's pop some more! We've been reunited, so let's battle! Hold on a second, though. What if one of these days we get teleported somewhere scary? Huh? How could it be scary when we're all together? Good point. But what if it's somewhere completely preposterous? Yeah, like where? Oh, I don't know. Um, how about... The edge of the universe! The edge of who now? <laughs> Sounds fun to me! <laughs> me too! Let's go! Go, 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 go! <laughs> what was that? I didn't see anything. Um, guys? <laughs> oh no! What are all those things falling around on the sky? Is it a new type of Puyo? We just got back from our last adventure! Don't we get it back from all the Puyo Puyo? No, no! Look closer! Go, go, go! What are you talking about? Guys, those aren't Puyos! Hey, you're right! They're blocks! Oh, just blocks. That's fine. Wait! That's not fine! There shouldn't be blocks! Why are there blocks here? How should I know? They're, they're really coming down all around us, Ringo. There's so many of them. Look, some of, the, some of them fell into a solid line. It's so freezing on my eyes. Oh my gosh, did you see that? The solid line just disappeared. Wait, are you thinking? Does this mean we're gonna get teleported again? I need you, O. It's time for a routine report. Ahem, <laughs> Captain's report. This is Captain T of the SS Tetra. I am broadcasting the signal via communications officer O. The constellation zone appears quiet. No ripples in space. Time to report. End of report. <laughs> hmm, do we really need to make these reports? I've never really questioned them before. You're right, it's my duty to make a report. Even though there's never been any problems out here, it's so peaceful. Huh? <laughs> what was that? About? What are the odds? Just as I said, we never have any problems out here. This is not good. You hear that? I heard someone talking inside the playroom. Did you hear O? <laughs> Let's go check it out. This is not good. I got teleported from home. 
and I'm in some weird place, and I'm all alone. This is so not good. Hmm. Captain's report. A girl in a non-form fitting outfit has materialized above the SS Tetra. I believe she is currently performing an improvised alien comedy routine. <laughs> Don't be hasty, O. Oh. Something about this seems not normal. I am unsure what our next course of action should be. Um, <clears throat> you right there. Huh? He's wearing some really tight fitting clothes. And he's trying to talk to me. Wait! Oh. Someone sent those squarish things that brought me here. I bet that someone was you! Uh. Sounds like the only solution here is that we should back. Wait, what? The, f the girl is in panic, but perhaps the battle might be the best course. I shall fight her until she calms down! <laughs> so, you know how to match them up and make the best character. Of course I do. Are you ready? Let's do this! Tetris time! Puya Puya time! Puyas on! What? She doesn't play Tetris? He doesn't play Puyo Puyo! But that's... Oh no! We're, we're starting! We're starting. <laughs> we were still able to battle even though he was using blocks instead of Puyo. And he's not too bad. What were those? I have never seen those jelly things before. Huh? You don't know what Puyos are? I do not. I have a great deal of questions for you. But first, let me introduce myself. I am T-Pose, and I am captain of this vessel, Starship Tetra. I have the ability to control and clear Tetra Minos. Uh-huh, so that's what Tetris is. Well, my name is Rainbow, and I can pop Puyos to make them disappear! <laughs> so those round things are Puyos? Uh-huh, and sometimes when we pop them, it sends us off to different worlds. It's sort of, kind of, like, well, a uh, portal. Anyhow, I'm sorry for barging in like this. It wasn't on purpose, I swear. But, um, maybe you can help me? Hmm. It's strange. Now that we battled, I feel like I can trust you. Really? Me too. Say, T, I was with a few of my friends before we arrived. Uh, there's a chance they were sent to the ship. They might be just as panicked as I was. Roger, let's go search the SS Tetra together! Thanks, T. 